Are aliens real? While there are strong opinions, Congress is on the hunt for definitive proof. A classified hearing this week on UFOs comes at a time when acceptance of the possibility of extraterrestrial life is peaking in America. And a new pattern of social media users claiming 10-foot aliens are already here, taking over Miami malls and visiting people's backyards. Let's start here. This week, members of the House Oversight Committee will discuss UFOs behind closed doors. At the meeting with lawmakers will be American intelligence officers and government watchdogs who oversee the intel community. This is something that's been happening more and more often. Congress asking government officials what they know about UFOs. There's been an uptick of activity on Capitol Hill concerning the topic ever since 2020, when the federal government quietly admitted that several Navy pilots have encountered unidentified aerial phenomena, or UAPs. Videos were released of some of the instances, for which there is still no explanation of what they are and how they got here. Fast forward to last year, bombshell testimony from former intelligence official David Grush reignited the UFO community after he claimed the government had in its possession non-human biologics from a recovered UFO and that the government was reverse engineering on UFOs to try and learn its technology. The Pentagon denies such claims. It's not only Congress with a heightened curiosity into UFOs. The share of Americans who believe UFO sightings are proof of alien life rose from 20% in 1996 to 34% in 2022, according to a YouGov poll. An Ipsos poll found that nearly half of Americans believe in UFOs, while one in 10 surveyed said they've actually witnessed one. An incident in Miami last week sparked some believers online to cry alien when a large police presence was spotted at the mall. Have you ever seen this many police and emergency vehicles responding to a fight at a mall? Why do they have every single police officer in the city there? And what of the reports of the 10 foot tall alien creatures that were supposedly being fired upon? Online users spectated 10 foot aliens had to be the reason for such a large police presence. But police say, it was a large brawl between teenagers. This incident reminiscent of the one in Vegas last year when a teenager called police claiming to see an alien in his backyard. It has big eyes and looking at us and it's still there. So there's two people or two subjects that are in your backyard? Correct, and they're very large. Nine feet, 10 foot, they look like aliens to us. Big eyes, they have big eyes and they're not human. They're 100% they're not human. Some members of Congress are openly believers in other life being out there. So-called credible witnesses have come forward in recent years describing their accounts with the unknown. As put by Mike Panicello of the UFO Network of Connecticut, believers are not the people with the tinfoil hats anymore.